So on Snapchat, I found the cool little jump roping bitmoji. So I wanted to create a little scene and use my animated bitmoji. Change the background, choose an image, Google image, I'm going to do two background scenes. So I'm going to come over here to my slides, right click, and new slide. Got to get rid of this again. Highlight it and then click delete. Right click or go up to backgrounds and you want to change the background. Choose an image. Google searched and I blacktop playground and I found this one. Where is it? This one. That's a water park. Let's do another one. Oops. Change background. And let's do this one. So this way I'll have a few different options, a few different scenes. And now all I have to do is add my Bitmoji. So got to jump over to Snapchat. Going to record my Bitmoji with Snapchat. When you first open your Snapchat, you'll see a big circle in the middle, and next to it, you might see another circle. Click on that circle. Right below it, you're going to see the two overlapping circles. Click on that. Then it's going to take you to the screen where you can scroll through and find the one that's jumping rope. You want to make sure you're looking for the silhouetted images. Once you've done that, you click on it. It'll bring it into your filters, I guess you call them, um, effects. And then you want to press that center circle button to record. And then you are going to download. So now that I've recorded my Bitmoji jumping rope off of Snapchat, I've downloaded it to my computer and now I'm going to go to unscreen.com forward slash upload. And then I'm going to upload my clip, go to my computer, and bring it over here. My clip of my Bitmoji. As you can see, the brown desk with the brown hair did not work well. Let's do green screen. Okay, so I've re-recorded using a green background. Let's see if that helps it. So we've got the green background. So it's downloading, it looks good. Looks much better. So we're gonna download this. So it took a few tries and I got the perfect one. There we go. And I'm gonna paste her here too. Control C, I already did, so Control V, and there she is. Insert Word Art. With your dimensions because she's so much bigger would make her look makes her look like she's definitely closer to you and that's how you make the animated bitmoji scene